So, a little bit of a backstory. I've had regular massages now for the last 20 years. You know, I'm big into well-being and taking care of yourself. And I had a regular person in the UK before I moved to the US, mostly a foot massage, which was very good. And then when I came to New York, um, you know, I had lots of different ones and I used to go to one regularly in Brooklyn on Smith Street, that was really good. One in the East Village, that was good. And then one on the Upper West Side, which wasn't as good. So it was normally Brooklyn was the go-to place because that was really good. And, you know, it's just something that, you know, I'm into. My mother's into it. And I kind of uh, got that from her, having regular massages, you know, well-being. And been in Tulsa for two years now and look for different people. Had a couple of massages. Meh. Not that good. And came to a place... Uh, maybe six months ago. I don't know if you can see that. It's a, a beauty school called Clary Sage. And, you know, teach massage and, and cosmetology and barbering and all that. Anyway, had it a couple of times here. And, uh, went up to snuff. And, you know, if you're paying $60, $50, $60 for a massage, it has to be good. And I've had massages in the UK, I've had massages in China, in the US, in Europe. And I know what I like. I know what I like and I know what's good. So when you get a shit one, nah, you know, it turns you off, especially if you pay good money for it. Anyway, the few times I had it here before, three times I think before, eh, meh. And then the last time before now, I had one just five minutes ago, there was a new person that I'd never had before. And I can tell you, I don't know if you can see my eyes properly, look like piss holes in the snow. Yeah, just, I don't know what day it is. Honestly, I can't think straight, talk straight. I'm surprised I can even do this video. But yeah, absolutely amazing. So I'm, I'm not gonna tell you who she is, well, it is, is a female, obviously, because I want to keep her all to myself. You know, I'm selfish, so, yeah, nobody's going to know unless I decide to reveal her identity. But, yeah, it's just absolutely amazing. And I suffer with a bit of sciatica. You know, I've been practicing martial arts for 20 years, being thrown on the floor. And, yeah, I do get, because I'm tall as well, like, I get sciatic pain. What? Once in, a, once in a while, you know. And I said that to her the first time. And she said, do I have permission to, to massage your butt? And I was like, of course you do. You know, just get on with it. And, you know, joking around. And she was pressing on these places on my butt. You know, I've had my butt massage before, obviously. But she was pressing on these places. And it just instantly felt, I, in, I instantly felt relief. And, you know, I'm saying all of this, that the point of this is, you know, if you don't go for a regular massage, maybe try one. You know, it's so beneficial to you. You, uh, you know, you, people work out, they eat well, and a massage is such an amazing thing that enables you to keep your body in check um, and to understand and keep your body in 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 the in the right form. Like I say, we eat well and we work out and have a massage. You know, it's so beneficial. Stress reliever, relaxes your muscles. If you're a regular workout person like me, I work out four or five times a week. Practice martial arts a few times a week. So you need that uh, rest on the body, and you need that recovery. And yeah, I'm just, yeah, I don't know what's going on. I don't even know what I'm saying, actually. So I'm going home now to chill out. Yeah, not do much of anything. So anyway, if you live in Tulsa, come to Clary Sage College. You may or may not get the uh, the best masseuse in, uh, in Oklahoma. 
or I'd say the United States. Who knows? Anyway, if you're not a regular massage person, go and have one. Treat yourself. It'll be the best $50 you've ever spent. Peace. Have a great weekend.